My name is Bulelani Nzuzo. I'm born and bred in Bekweni, Etube, and uh, I am an emerging filmmaker. I am currently covering a documentary titled uh, Scenes of Mbakweni in collaboration of uh, a youth activist called Usia Bonga Stengani and an international uh, producer and author called uh, uh, Tulani Poni. Um, the reason why we want to send this message is because we are living in, in a community that is currently in a pandemic of illegal dumping. So as a young person who is born and bred in Mbakweni, illegal dumping has always been a pandemic. I always said that why can't young people or community members see a gap in the market where they can actually start recycling things, you know. There's paper recycling, there's glass recycling and there's plastic recycling. And I sat down and asked myself, is it because people are not educated about health and hygiene or do they not know the effects that illegal dumping has? And then I met Sia, who went around beautifying the Queenie. That's when I realized that, you know what, irrespective of whatsoever resources, limited resources he has, I'm just telling his story will put him on the map, you know. So I reached out to Sia and uh, we collaborated on a campaign keep, uh, called Keeping the Queenie Clean. And without knowing that it would get so much momentum, it actually unfolded to us making a documentary about it. The message that I'd like to tell the community out there is uh, to put an emphasis that we should keep the Queen clean. A clean environment is a friendly environment. And uh, as people who want to live and make this community a tourism attraction, cleanliness needs to be an emphasis. So cleaning, cleaning and more cleaning is what I want to emphasize out there. Uh, my name is Sewa Ngastengane. I'm a community activist who's also passionate about greening and developing my township, of course. Uh, I'm, I'm quite overwhelmed when it comes to the documentary, uh, the Bule line and the tools. Um, I'm really excited about it and looking forward to the documentary. Um, the documentary it says a lot itself, uh, which is the, the tackling illegal dumping and putting the awareness as much as possible when it comes to um, waste management as well as um, preventing illegal dumping. Uh, my name is Tuani Gladwell Boni. I'm an international book author, but in a project uh, of this documentary, uh, Sins of Mbegweni, I'm a co-director and a script writer. So, uh, in terms of London, I've been introducing the Queen all the way throughout its uh, massiveness because there are lots of things that are great and beautiful already about the Queen, which I want to emphasize to the world out there. It's just that now with the documentary itself, we want to do something different. We want to introduce something else to people because we want to teach community as to how to keep the place as beautiful and as clean and tidy as it should be. Because at the end of the day, to attract interest into the tourism out there or to the tourists, the tourists out there, we need a clean space. We need a space where they can feel free to walk on. Because with those illegal dump sites, we can't be able to make them feel as comfortable as they should be. Well, Dragon State Municipality just launched an app called C-Click Fix where you can uh, anonymously report illegal dumping. 